Retro fans, Satchman2000 here again with a new video. Um, actually, it's not really a new video, it's a better definition tour uh, of my retro room. I got a new video camera for my birthday, so I thought I'd give you a, a, a tour again of my room, but this time you might actually be able to see things. Um, so, same kind of thing, here we go, we'll just start. Uh, here are my Mega CD games. Just a quick pan down. Now again, I'm going to do a proper tour. That's some Sega Saturn stuff. Um, original PlayStation games. Oh, and the lights kicked in. There we go. Um, and some original, more original PlayStation games. Um, there is my Atari Jaguar. The CD32, which is playing Banshee at the moment. That's what you saw at the beginning. Uh, the Super Nintendo, of course, and all my loose cartridges, Atari 2600, uh, Super Nintendo and N64 games are in there. Um, we have a couple of cases for CD32 games or just loose CD games. Um, here are my uh, Wii games. my Retro Gamer magazine collection uh, there's what, 7 8 years worth there, whatever um, I'll just pan a little bit at the back here these are my Mega Drive games going into my oops, <laughs> Master System games, I'll just bounce a camera around there my little signs that I made um, I like this, Pitfall is one of my favourite Atari games and I managed to find this cover scan on atariage.com it's actually signed by David Crane which is awesome uh, I wish I'd got that for real but uh, I think it looks pretty good um, anyway we've got the Wii sitting there the Xbox 360 and all these consoles and everything are all hooked up to that TV there uh, because I don't need a light gun for any of them so it's an HD LCD TV um, up above, as you've seen before, I've got the N64, um, the original PlayStation is in there, um, and all the boxes for various bits and bobs, my Master System converter, some Sega Saturn stuff, uh, arcade joystick for the PS2, and steering wheel. Over to the good corner, um, I'll give you a bit of a better look at my Yars Revenge flyer. I think it was 1982 or 1983 that came out, so I quite like that. Yards Revenge is one of my favourite games on the, the Atari. I love the Atari 2600. And my Joe Satriani Shrine, there we go. Pictures of my mugshot with all the Satriani guys, uh, various signed things. And my Jeff Campitelli drumskin, signed. Hurrah! Um, I've got a little TV hooked up at the moment to the PlayStation 2 playing the Sonic, uh, what was it, Sonic Mega Collection. Um, we have the Atari 2600, 6 switch version, it's not a heavy 6er, um, it's the Hong Kong version but it's still, still great, love it. The Sega Saturn with the light kicking in, and my action replay cartridge. My Mega Drive and my Mega CD, both Mark 1 models work perfectly and I've got the Master System Converter as well to play Master System games. The chunky PlayStation 2, um, which I love obviously, PlayStation 1, backwards compatible, excellent, great machine. Um, the original Xbox, I love that as well, um, with my DVD thing. And my Dreamcast, a totally under underrated Sega console um, for arcade ports and things, just awesome. And obviously my shelf of games, here we go. So, some CD32 stuff. All my Atari 2600 controllers are in there. We've got the Dreamcast collection. Do you know what I'm going to do? Let me just turn this light off and try this again. There we go, right. So, the Dreamcast collection. Not too bad. Down to the PlayStation 2 stuff. And again, 
I will do a proper here's the stuff I have sort of video. Uh, oh, I'm going too far. The Xbox collection. Atari Jaguar carts. Um, I don't have any unboxed ones, I like all the box stuff. Uh, one Super Nintendo box, of course it's Star Wars, anybody that knows me knows I'm a massive Star Wars fan. Goes with the territory really. Um, my Atari 2600 boxed stuff. I love the Parker Brothers games, um, those are all complete with all documentation and everything. Uh, Empire Strikes Back is probably ranked up there, I know I've just said there's loads of favourite games but that is definitely one of them. A uh, couple of Mega CD games. Uh, further down here we have uh, GameCube stuff and a couple of Xbox overspill. And then right down on the floor here, oi, we've got the Sega Saturn stuff and Xbox 360. Very small collection of Xbox 360. But that's it, that is the, the better definition to her. Hopefully you'll have been able to see things a little bit clearer. Um, if there's any questions or you want to know any more about any of the stuff, uh, give me a shout, leave comments on the video, let me know what you'd like to see more of or anything like that. Um, and I will be taking time to go through, especially now I've got a video camera, I will be taking time to go through um, and film the actual collections and show you the actual games individually and console reviews and all that kind of stuff. So once again, thanks for watching and uh, I'll speak to you soon. Cheers.